Dude, there is no getting into this box though. Where'd this come from? Guys or gals out there know what this is and how much it's worth. Please let me know in the comments down below. What is that in there? There's three of them. I think they're piranhas. What is going on, Crows? Welcome back to another video. This video gets a little dark. No, no. <laughs> no, do not do that. I actually made a purchase that I never thought I'd say that I made. Frankly, you didn't make the purchase. You zelled me the money, and I made the Same purchase. exact thing. Nope. I still paid for it. Nope, that's not the same thing. Before I get started and show you what is inside this box, we have a sponsor for today's video. Hey! Today's video is sponsored by API. Am I even centered in the camera? Oh, I am. Hey, got a fish mask. <laughs> API has been in the industry for nearly 60 years, developing and perfecting products for your aquariums and ponds. From test kits, water conditioners, fish medications, and even nutritional products, API truthfully just has it all. There's a reason why all my tanks are so clear. Just yesterday, I was doing a big old water change on the 5500 gallon, and I used the stress coat. And just like every API product, you just read the front, it has everything you'll need to know about the product and what it does and the back as well benefits when to use directions for treating tap water it literally has it all right on the bottle I love having API on hand knowing that anything can go wrong at any moment with all this inside this building but I am prepared and you should be too today we're moving over a fish from that tank far in the distance into this tank right here oh I got him I got him there he goes our ball of shark is inside his new aquarium look at him and he's got a lot of space to swim around. Now obviously before I go and put the fish into this tank, I do water tests. And that's what I use the Pond Master test kit for. It's got it all right here. And along with this, they've got so many products like the stress coat that I used in the pond for the water change, that would have helped here. And even stuff like this, the stress zine. Keeps aquariums clean, contains live bacteria to consume sludge, reduces aquarium maintenance. They've got it all, Caferos. Go check out the links down below. If you don't want to buy online, go to any local fish or pet store and they'll probably have API in there. There as well. Thank you so much API for sponsoring today's video. Now, let's get back into it. So how does this work, Brenton? So I don't have like access to the dark web and I know a lot of like the dark web videos that you see online are most likely fake because most people can't just get on the dark web. It doesn't work like that. We know someone though who can. So we told him- No, I don't, you do. I know someone who <laughs> can and not even in my state, not even in this state, and I did this before, the dark web, people like to make money, right? So they'll make all different types of mystery packages, sneakers, uh, like, you know, like the fake And designs. you said most likely what's in this box isn't just what we ordered, it's actually things no. along with what we ordered. And it can go one of a few ways, right? You could order it from someone who's kind of legit, you could order it from someone who's kind of just scamming, trying to make money, or you could order something that's actually a little freaky. I don't know, it's coming off the dark web, there's people all over there to do tons of different things. But last time I contacted this guy, he found someone who not only sold exotic animals on the dark web, but sold fish. So that's what's in the box. Well, we're hoping so. That is what we asked to get. It was just some fish off the dark web. For this, a freshwater tank. This actually went to his house before it came here. And then he shipped it here. Hopefully he didn't finesse us because that would suck. We truly have no idea what this box contains. Let's just say that. Not it a clue. Might not even be a fish. It's not like Amazon when you get a purchase confirmation. Uh, so don't, actually, don't count I'm on it working. I'm actually scared. Yeah, no, it could be like <laughs> something odd. Look at this disturbing. thing. I can't show the label, um, but look at this. It is wrapped in saran wrap all the way around. Let's get to opening. Uh, yeah, I mean, <laughs> let's just open it. <clears throat> no! Imagine! My goodness gracious, dude. Take it easy. Dude, there is no getting into this box, though. Where'd this come from? Shop. Can I say that? I don't know. We're just gonna bleep it just in case. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, why, what are you doing, dude? Stop, I was trying to make it like dark and cinematic. You were supposed to put music over that, and you didn't. I didn't add any music, you actually. Just, you literally just ruined that. All right. Dude, this guy was not playing around. Oh! Dude, there could be a bag of fish in there, dude. dude whatever was in there, I made right, just went right through. through it. Oh, yeah. I did go directly through directly what through. was ever, whatever was in here. A bag of fish, baby! I'm honestly not going to lie, I didn't think we were going to straight open a bag. What did you get in yours? I did not get, uh, it was not that easy for me. What did you get in yours? I got an ammo crate. <laughs> okay. I got a straight up, ooh. Loki, this is, there's a CD. 
22 yeah! Yeah! <laughs> What the f***? It's got it! No Yo, let's watch some freaking 22 Jump Street, bro. I forgot how to get these out, look. Bro. You gotta push the middle, remember? Who even Back in the good old days. Wait, wait, did anybody use DVDs? <laughs> I haven't seen like a genuine- I use DVDs for something else. Oh. Sorry, Mia. Okay. 22 let's Jump Street came in our box. Now, I'm assuming they put stuff like this in it in case of I, scannings or something? Yeah, Who knows? I mean, they a lot of the times, like, they'll just stick the most random things in there. I mean, I've seen it different for other people, although who knows like who actually got something from the real dark web. This is pretty straightforward though. There's a bag. They spray painted. And it is black. Mine was black too. My bag that I got was also black. It's kind of scary, I'm not gonna lie. The, the cool thing about it is we have no idea what's in the bag. Gosh, it's literally spray painted black. Unless it's actually just black. Well. Let's pour this into a bucket. I'm trying to see what I got. You know what I got last what? time? I got a lungfish. Oh, oh, what is that? Oh, 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 oh my goodness. What? Oh my goodness. <laughs> what? 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 <laughs> what? <laughs> Makes sense. I thought it was an eel. And That's kind of something sketchy yeah, too. Yeah, it was weird. I don't even think it was like a legal lungfish in my I'm state. not going to lie to you, bro. These look like baby piranha. You can see? Which is totally illegal in our state. <laughs> 100% illegal. I'm gonna be honest, bro. I don't see nothing. I don't know what he's looking at. <laughs> I don't even, I'm, I'm expecting it to be like a guppy. Or a, or, or a goldfish, it's so easy for people to finesse with this. So Paul could have absolutely lost like a quick 350 in this video, so. Dude, that would be terrible. Um, Here's a bin. Gosh, this is like actually sketchy. I have no <laughs> idea. Bro. Ready? Yeah. Look at look at the fish. Look at the fish. What is that in there? There's three of them. Oh my god. They're piranhas, dude. Piranhas. I think they're piranhas. No way you act. Dude, what? is that not a piranha? Wait. Is that not a piranha, bro? It might be a Paku. Oh my god. Bro, I swear that's a piranha. Only you would actually get a pack. That's not fair. That's sick as hell. Dude. This is bad. This is bad. Is he legal? I just won't upload you're, the video. No, you're, in, you're literally incriminating yourself. <laughs> I got piranhas, I've dude. been through this. You don't want to do the oh, wait, illegal fish in your state wait operation. A not a piranha. That's not a Not a I don't think that's a piranha. I think it's a silver dollar. It looked like a piranha from overhead. It looks like a Paku, but I, seen, I think it's a see, silver like, dollar. You know, the red really... We're going to do some research here. Yeah. I'm 99% sure it's a silver dollar. There's four of them. Silver dollar, God, that's such a, that is a piranha, silver dollar. Oh. Piranha, silver dollar. Dang, yeah. oh my. All right, I typed in silver dollar, that's what we got. Silver dollar, <laughs> silver dollar. Oh, sick, you got a Speaking coin. Speaking of coin, dude. That was the weirdest coin, this is haunted. This is haunted. Yo. I don't know. I just looked up silver dollar and that came up. And a coin was in, was in here. I got a coin. All right, so we got 22 Jump Street, a coin, which we're gonna have to search this coin. Low key, out. this is a dope coin. We're gonna search this I'm not coin. A, is oh my any, gosh. Anyone it's kinda heavy. It's definitely silver. Anybody yeah. know like coins? Is, this might be worth some money. 1992. 1922. Why would someone put a That coin? is real silver. Anything under 1964 is 90 real is 90% silver. Yep. Oh yeah. That's silver. That's silver, all right. And our fish are indeed a silver dollar. Unfortunately. Still really cool though, dude. Not gonna lie, that's still really cool. Not as cool as a piranha. They're closely related to piranhas and pakus. Dude, he just literally ripped that. <laughs> Something's seriously wrong with you, kid. I'm gonna put you in that box and ship you back to my shop. Ooh. I'm actually genuinely curious more about the coin now than the fish. Give me a second. Something super crazy about technology is you go on eBay. Let's see what pops up. Wait, please. I bought this mystery box for $350, so. $349.99. Please tell me it's that. Please tell me it's that. A thousand dollar Please coin. tell me it's that. Is that not oh it? Oh my god! It's a thousand dollars! Wait, 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 wait. If any of you coin guys or gals out there know what this is and how much it's worth, please let me know in the comments down below. Here's the back of it. Comment down below. I know it's real silver. It's definitely real silver. It's heavy. And sounds like real silver. Back in the bag. If, uh, yeah, if you know what that is, comment down below. 
Might be worth $1,000, might be worth $5. I don't know. So we got 22 Jump Street. That's going in the trash, by the way. As much as I love 22 Jump Street, who the heck uses CDs? <laughs> this silver coin that's going in my safe, because that's really cool. And then four piranhas. Those are not piranhas. They are bootlegged piranhas <laughs> that we now need to acclimate into our aquarium here. I'm gonna put them into this beautiful tank. Inside the tank, we have the Bala Shark that we had just transferred over, you saw that. Our Paratilapia, which is a beautiful, beautiful tilapia species. I don't even know what the heck it is. And we have at the bottom our Golden Albino Axolotl, who's been living with these fish for weeks now. So, I know there's gonna be commenters, Axolotls can't live with fish, they're gonna get eaten. They're fine, okay? I've literally had the thing living in there forever with them. That's to the people that thought that, not to the normal people. I love you guys. <laughs> they're so cool. You know what? I think back in the day I actually cast into one of these things. One of my first videos on YouTube. I can't imagine what those fish went through. I really hope that they all survive. Because the only way to find out is put them in and hope for the best. I've got so much stuff under there. Here we go. My little piranhas. Look at these little guys. We're hanging out with our parrot tilapia. There's plenty of flow in this tank. As you can see, they're swimming. This other guy's in the corner. He's kind of scared. You all right, buddy? I promise you there's nothing going to kill you in this tank. I promise. Oh, look, he's a little scared. He's definitely scared. God, they are cute. The big old eyeball, they're cute. They're kind of like you. Thanks, man. The other three are right here, and they're just swimming in a little school, which I'm sure the fourth one eventually, where is, where'd he go? Oh, there he is. I'm sure this fourth one will uh, eventually find his spot. But as you can see, they are so adorable. We got a new addition to the tank. Let me turn the lights off in here so you can get a better view of this tank. Such a cool aquarium. I've never ordered anything off the dark web before, but I can tell you what. If you want 22 Jump Street, it's something you should do. And if uh, you want a silver coin, which seems to be real at least. No, don't order anything off the dark web. It's definitely not smart. Again, it's almost impossible to do. My fish came in a black bag, a dark black bag. I will say, if you guys wanna see more of this stuff, make sure to smash the like button down below. Let me know in the comments, maybe I'll go and order a $1,000 mystery box. You know what? If this video gets 50,000 likes, I will order a $1,000 mystery box off the dark web. $1,000. If you're not subscribed already, make sure to hit that subscribe button down below. This fish tank is looking amazing since I've got the filtration working. As you can see, filtration is now running, water's high, and the water is also clear. Everyone just ate, I literally just fed everything. Woo. They're fired up. Oh yeah, here you go buddy. Yeah, look at them. That water is clear. Check that out. Wow. What's up, Thumb? Look at Thumb, big old Thumb. And the Paku. I thought I had a bunch of you. I think I made a fat come up. You let me know if you know what the heck this is. Thank you so much for watching, and uh, we'll see you right back here in the next one. Say bye, little fish. Hey.